If you're like me, JavaScript has become an important part of your Rails applications, driving the behavior of your app in the browser. In Ruby, we use testing frameworks like MiniUnit and RSpec to make sure our code behaves as we intend. We can do the same thing in JavaScript using Jasmine. Jasmine is a behavior-driven development framework for testing your JavaScript code. It does not depend on other JavaScript frameworks. It does not require a DOM. And it has a clean, obvious syntax so that you can easily write tests. Jasmine doesn't need Rails to run, but can integrate into your Rails app by adding the Jasmine gem to your gem file. then load it up using Bundler. To initialize Jasmine, you need to do a one-time initialization step. This will install a custom JavaScript test runner, along with sample, specs in spec JavaScript, and their implementation in public JavaScript. In Jasmine, your test suites are called a spec. Take a look at the sample spec for a music player. This describes the behavior of the music player, describing things it should do or things it shouldn't. We run this spec using rake. This uses Selenium to run the test in your browser, returning the output on the console. Now, let's add a new spec describing behavior we haven't implemented yet. Here, we'll describe an about function it returns information about how the player has been implemented. In the test, we set expectations of what the function should return. If we run our spec again, we'll see this time the test will fail. We can fix this by implementing the missing function. Now we'll run our specs again, and hopefully they'll pass. You can see this time it's all green. And voila, you're testing JavaScript. To find out more about Jasmine and about how to do more advanced testing with Stubbs mocks and the DOM, visit pivotal.github.com slash Jasmine. Thank you.